We are here at the Loyola Archive with Kat, our resident archivist, and she is going to tell us a little bit of exciting news about some finds that she's made recently. Thanks, Scott. So uh, after a few weeks of going through the giant boxes of photos that we have here in the vault, uh, we've uncovered some pretty interesting news, and that is that at one point in time in the 1930s and 40s, Loyola Jesuit Center was home to not just priests, but apparently also dogs and cats. So you can see in these photos that we have Loy and Ola, the Loyola Jesuit Center dogs. And we know that they lived on the property because they even had dog houses on the property. And this is a picture of one of the cats on the property as well. So we like to think that uh, Loy and Ola came on September 3rd, 1934. We have a photograph of Father Stork giving, uh, sorry, receiving the leash of Loy the dog. Now, of the two dogs that are normally in the photographs, Loy is the larger dog and Ola is the smaller terrier-like dog. And so they are around from, like I said, the 1930s to 1940s. And there are so many cute photos of the dogs interacting with the retreatants throughout this time period. Uh, we have the dogs shaking hands. We have the dogs sitting in different poses. When there are large groups of retreatants, the dogs are always somewhere in the background. And we even have wonderful Christmas photos. This is Father Gruen and Father Ott uh, in the 1940s, in the early 1940s, in either 1940 or 41. And that down there was little tiny Ola right beneath the uh, the wreath and those two old-fashioned Christmas stockings back when people actually used their own stockings during Christmas time. So it was really, really cool. And so we're really thankful to have found all of this evidence and we're hoping to see what else we can uncover about Loyola Jesuit Center and the cats and dogs. I love my dog as much as I love you. Do you make faith? My dog will always come through. All he asks from me is the food to give him strength. All he ever needs is love and that he 